Infusion Setup This video covers the basics of the system setup for Infusion. For full instructions on the system, refer to the Sapphire's user manual, found on our website. Setting up the Sapphire system for Infusion includes turning the pump on, connecting the administration set to the medication reservoir, and to the pump, and priming it. Now, the pump can be programmed and connected to the patient. Turning on the pump. First, turn on the pump by pressing the on-off key. Note the screen is divided into three sections. Indication bar, showing the current state, the selected delivery mode, and battery level. If there is a drug library, the clinical care area and drug name are also shown. Main area, through which most actions are done, and toolbar, displays the additional actions available. Only relevant actions are shown. Connecting the administration set and priming. Administration set handling. The Sapphire administration set includes a cassette with anti-free flow valve, AFFV. When the valve protrudes outside, the line is clamped. When the valve is pressed in, the line is open. Once the set is connected to the medication reservoir, the set can be primed using the pump, or manually for non-PAV sets. First, ensure all clamps on the set are open and that the set is disconnected from the patient. To prime the non-PAV set manually, press the AFFV inwards until all air is discarded and the set is filled with the infusion solution. Once priming is complete, insert the cassette to the pump. Place the bottom part first and then click the top part into the lock. Alternatively, to prime any set with the pump, first attach the administration set to the pump. Place the bottom part first and then click the top part into the lock. Then, press the prime key on the toolbar. Ensure the set is disconnected from patient and press prime on the confirmation message screen. Note, the pump prime process can be stopped if all the air is removed by pressing finish prime on the toolbar. Ensure at the end of the process that all air was discarded and press OK. Otherwise, press prime again. When you need to remove the cassette, push the lock up and the cassette is discharged with the AFFV automatically engaged, preventing free flow. If the set includes a filter, invert it during priming. Position the filter lower than the end of the set to ensure proper wetting of the filter. This completes the setup. The pump is ready to be programmed, connected to a patient, and start the infusion delivery.